Hi everyone, out your world, this is Coins Kid. Just going to dive into uh, XRP once again. Thank you for your support, I really do appreciate it. Big up the Coins Kid crew. Thank you for your Telegram, your Patreon ship, and all of your support. And, and most importantly, thank you for being here and liking and sharing these videos. Okay, so right now you you are aware that XRP is in a bullish continuation pattern. Okay, you've got this inverse head and shoulders just there. This black, uh, black, this blue neckline is your resistance of the inverse head and shoulders. You've already broken out of it. You come up, hit a level of resistance, and you've fallen back to it as support. I mean, look at that. Look at that for support, that line at the moment. Okay, let's have a look at the four hourly time frame. Look at that, that's boss. Okay, so you had a little wick down, didn't quite come down to this 55. That would have been a nice little entry point there. You come back up and you started to create another little, uh, it is little, like a mini little sort of um, uh, breakout pattern just there. That's called a cup and handle pattern. You know, like the larger one that we're, we're anticipating on a, a larger time frame. Look, if you, if you start to come up now and you start to break that level of resistance, which you're going to see a continuation of the trend of 86 cents. So that's a nice little pump in itself. So if you do start to see XRP break 82 cents, you are looking at a lovely little uh, pump, just 5.5% up towards 86 cents. Continuation. And this is what I said to you about these waveforms, okay? If it moves up in waveforms like that, and as long as you can adhere to structural support, you're looking great for continuation. And that's exactly what XRP has done here. Look, you know, a little bit over extended, roll back to support. Where have you found support on the blue line, which is the, the neckline, right? That you hit in resistance, 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 roll back, come back, got through it, and you're now holding it as support like an absolute boss, okay, on the Ferrari time frame. And you're closing above it as support, so it's, it's great, it's golden. You're looking for continuation here, and in doing so, okay, you, you're creating this sort of little um, cup and handle pattern potentially just there, look, little cup and handle pattern, potentially come back a little bit might even have a retest of this yellow line which is a 20 ma you know at that point if you do see a little bit of rollover put some cheeky bids on the the yellow line because you've got a breakout pattern if you break above 82 cents you're looking at a lovely little long opportunity there for 88 cents and continuation of this uptrend that the xrp is in so you know rome wasn't built in a day these things do take time now there is yesterday i did spot a, 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 a big cup and handle pattern didn't i but in looking at that okay i wasn't fur enough with you here and i do apologize but you know in in a sense let's switch to the daily time frame just there okay this is a really really bullish pattern okay we're spotting loads of bullish reversal patterns for xrp at the moment it's looking good it's looking for continuation you know in full transparency if you roll over at this point and you start to correct and you lose these lows that's your bear market right there for xrp and, and crypto but so far we've got a lovely little recovery here we've not had any of these sort of patterns and these reversal patterns come into play in this entire correction that we've gone through for xrp you know these are the things that you need to see to get the confirmation bias of a reversal in the trend and right now you're doing exactly that okay you're getting above the emas you start to create a bullish cross on the, on the daily time frame a buy and go to the beat signal from coins kid where the 20 crosses a 55 if you can hold that support this is golden it's absolutely golden because the last time you did that look after a, a capitulation just then you start to get back up you absolutely took off into space here for xrp and you know you've got a future price projection up there of this next impulsive wave you know four dollars 55 i think it is would would see it towards you know it's all time high wouldn't it and that'd be amazing but obviously you're fully aware it is under a massive level of resistance not just from the trading action but from sec you know with a, with a, a suitcase law case or whatever you want to call it it's a load of rubbish anyway isn't it but anyway we've gone through that scenario but right now it's adhering to market structure it's holding support relatively well and it's looking for continuation you're breaking out of key levels of resistances and like i said to you the patterns are in play are valid until invalidated away the whole way down here we've had patterns you know breakdown structures and breakdown patterns and they've all been met okay i did say to you, if you lose this level of support you are potentially looking at a level down i think it was about 41 cents but at the minute you've invalidated that at the moment because you're breaking out of key levels of resistance Big inverted head and shoulders, beautiful double bottom. You know, even this, you know, let's take a look again. I'll just remind you, so from there to there, you got breakout target and you broke this level of resistance. This white line here is your neckline and you've got a, you're in, you're in basically a target of, of roughly 90 cents. Do you see that? So yesterday, I did say to you that if we eventually get to those targets like this, you're going to come up to this level of resistance, aren't you? Just here, okay? Potentially forming a big, um, cup and handle pattern like that eventually down the line fall back looks bad people shitting them pants you know come back to a key level of support break up and you got a breakout target but what i didn't show you was that look this is the primary target of this uh falling broadening channel this is where you created the channel uh, i do apologize for not showing you that so like i said to you when you break out of these channels of resistance 
you, you know you hold them as support look we held it the whole way down there look at that as support it's a it's a bullish reversal continuation pattern so we're in multiple reversal patterns here you know this is where you created this pattern this is where you fell into it and created this falling channel which i told you full transparency when you were doing this i said to you this is bullish <laughs> even though people didn't think it was it is bullish and eventually when you break out you do eventually get to your target so right now the projection for xrp is up not down and in each role it's holding support like a boss okay so far so good it's looking for continuation there's no reason to think otherwise okay so it's looking really healthy at the moment uh, you know I'm not, if i see any different i will tell you so but like i said it's not going to be easy it's going to do it in waveforms okay and that's exactly what it's doing it's conforming so it's great um but equally you know within this right look at this this is even more bullish okay so you know a full transparency again just here we, we, we come down like this look we're coming down we're coming down we're coming down and you're doing all this all this chop 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 what are you creating you're creating a massive big cup and handle pattern at that point you know up here on this on this level of resistance just there you're creating a neckline of a big cup and bigger cup and handle where you may start to get rejected again but when you break that level of resistance again equally you've got another breakout target from the bottom down there to the top you know and these are all bullish patterns and this is where you can see a beautiful break and a little pump up towards 281 for xrp so these are all good it's it's patterns and it's progress that are going to be made in the future but again not got a crystal ball so yeah it's looking relatively healthy for continuation is xrp uh, unless we start to roll over and lose key, lose key levels of structural support you're looking for continuation in this bull market and, and slowly but surely it's getting there isn't it okay so that's it. I hope you enjoyed that update on uh, XRP. So far, so good. Uh, it, it bounced off a key level of support and it's looking for continuation. And right now, you know, we are on the cusp of painting this beautiful buy and go to the beach signal from Coins Kid. We get that and, you know, go up, get a bit, bit of an extended. If we start to roll back to that as support and hold, wow. See you later. Take care, everyone. I'm back tomorrow. Another update on XRP. Stay healthy, stay, stay strong, stay tuned. Bye bye.